Listen, Bab, I know you're not stupid. <laughs> Aren't I? And this is the last thing we wanted. All right. What's that then? It's why I haven't come back to tell you the truth. Look, I'm sorry. I thought it was over, but it wasn't. The minute my back was turned. It wasn't his fault. It just happened. Yeah. Well, so put me into an ambulance. I could have been dead for all you knew. All right. <sighs> He's such a dick. And what about me? Fine. You're a bitch. Do you know that? Yeah, well. I hope they lock you up like the animal that you are. What? So you can get rid of me again? Yeah, yeah. Right, last time. Good old shoulder to cry on. You didn't give a shit about him. Never could stick it for yourself, could you? How many other guys did you have on the go then, eh? Didn't stop you from putting your greasy little mitts all over Liam, though, did it? While I was writing in prison, how do you think that made me feel, eh? Well, if you hadn't been a thief all your life. No, you were the thief there, not me. Need to be somewhere. No. Then what are you? Nothing. What have you done? Nothing. You called the cops on me. Why would I do that? If you have. Breaking the law only a few weeks after getting out. You wouldn't do that, would you, Carly? I'll kill you. Now, I know I'm not at my best. Doesn't stop me from going into the kitchen. No! Look under the kitchen sink. <coughs> Someone's been hiding stuff there. Jesus, Janie. What would your probation officer say? All that gear. Carly's been a naughty girl again. You're bluffing. Am I?